I went to Walmart yesterday morning and I got Qatar Hero World Tour and I got Walmart to match Target's price. <laughs> It's better to go early to Walmart and to the other stores because there's usually not a lot of people out except on the day after Thanksgiving and the day after Christmas, except Christmas time, you get a lot of people in the return lines. People were waiting outside of the Best Buy in Macon since midnight the day before Thanksgiving, which would make it the day of Thanksgiving. What I don't get is... Why would you do that and miss Turkey Day? Some people have asked, um, what is my most embarrassing moment? Well, pff, I have many, but I'll only tell one in this vlog. And one of my embarrassing moments was when I was playing baseball with a friend of mine. I was about seven or eight years old, and he hit the ball over the fence in the neighbor's yard, which he always did. And I always ended up having to climb the fence to get the ball. Well, I did that. I threw the ball back over. I went to climb back over the fence. And the back of my jeans got caught on the fence. And I tried every which way to get down. And I finally did. And I ripped the back of my pants. And I didn't know that until I went to bat. And I hit the ball. started running. And I felt cool air on my rump. And my friends were laughing, and my friend was laughing, and I realized, oh, God, I ripped my pants. And by this time, my friend was on the ground laughing, and I had to run inside and change my pants. Embar very embarrassed, but that I had a lot more embarrassing moments, but that was one of them that stuck out in my mind. I like to reflect on the old 99 Ways days, and not only do I remember Bill Elder, but I also remember a guy named Brad Majors. And Brad, if you just so happen to watch the vlog, drop me a line. I like to hear how it's been going for you. But I was talking to Bill Elder, and I heard that Bill El that Brad Majors is now a DJ somewhere else or something. He's not in radio anymore. But if memory serves me correctly, I w it was after school. My mom would pick me up from elementary school. I'd be riding home. We'd be listening to 99 Ways and be listening to Brad Majors. If I'm not mistaken, that was him on in the afternoon. Might have been David Nolan, but I'm pretty sure it was Brad Majors. And, by the way, if you... Getting back to Bill Elder for a second. If you get a chance, go to Bill TV Making and watch Bill's vlogs. They are hysterical. I mean, <laughs> this guy still has a lot of creative energy. But also what's sad about 99 Ways was not long after Bill left, um, about two or three, about a year later, it went to 105.5. They became big ways, and then recently they switched to AM, and it's now an all-automated station. So Ways is pretty much nothing now, so, and it's real sad. I mean, seriously, where do people get the gall to... Let go of all live DJs and just have a computer run it. I mean, it's stupid. Now, granted, it does help, but they, but people still need live DJs to, you know, provide some comic relief. What do you think we're supposed to do? Wait for a song period to come on? I'm in the handbell choir at church, and the church is called First Christian Church in Warner Robins. And we are performing this Sunday, and we have to wear these white gloves to protect the bells. And the gloves, we're, I, I don't have a problem with the gloves, but the gloves make us look like we're Michael Jackson impersonators. <laughs> this Saturday, I'm going to have to get up bright and early and go to the meeting place to get in a car to go to the CVS Pharmacy parking lot to get on the Macon State College Christmas float for the Warner Robins Christmas Parade. 
I've been in parades for the past five years since 2003. I've been in a parade from 2003 to 2006. I've been in the parade with the Northside High School Blue Wind Marching Band. And in 2007 and this year, I've been in the parade with Macon State College. The only parade that I ever watched recently, just sat and watched, was when the Warner Robins American Little League World Champs had their parade back in, I believe it was 2007, um, had their parade. And even then, I was filming the parade for Macon State College Television. Oh, by the way, I almost forgot. Thanks to Bill Elder for the old uh, 99 Ways picks. I greatly appreciate it, man. Thanks a lot. Next time, we are stepping more into Christmas.